I remember now. The winner of the year was Hesperia Gales. No idle talk. You'll crash, Dingo. In the final 30 seconds, Henry G trashed out from field out. Man, we had a great time that night. 20 to touchdown. Can't wait for the new season. Position for landing. The people on Mars can start getting excited. I still have 200 more hours. Be a good kid and the time will fly. <laughs> That's unusual. What is? Indications of Metatron, but it's way too shallow. Angie, I want to change the landing point. I'll check it out. Okay. Rick, you hear that? I'll be back soon. Dingo, what team won in 66? I don't know much about back then. Uh. Piece of junk. I reckon Ross Narciss is going to win this year. <laughs> there goes your entire salary again. I'm sure of it. I'm on the ground. The Metatron is not very deep. And it's very strong. It wasn't here last time I came. Going back. Going back. Going Shut up. Is it debris? The observation crews are goofing off again. What the hell is that? Anything wrong? I found something interesting. I'll check it out. Enemy approaching. There is
identified as unmanned orbital frame, Raptor. Be careful not to get surrounded. Confirming the enemy destroyed. What is the efficiency of this frame? This is orbital frame Jehuti. Do you want me to explain how to manipulate the frame? Who is this? This is detached backup battle unit, Ada. So this is a battle computer, isn't it? More reliable than the Lev's navigators. I'm completely different. Do you request control instructions? Yes, Ada. Please. Please. I will explain about moving. Jehuti follows the left stick operations. Press the triangle button to ascend. Press the X button to descend. Press the R2 button while moving to dash. Holding down the R2 button keeps you dashing. This is very effective to move quickly or dodge enemy attacks. Ending the explanation about moving. Jehuti is set up not to do that right now. Jehuti is set up not to do that right now. I will explain about dash attacks. Press the square button while dashing to perform a dash attack. In a close range battle, a dash attack becomes a dash blade. In a long distance battle, you can lock on to multiple enemies by pressing the square button. You can fire a homing laser by releasing it. Using homing lasers consumes sub-gauge power. The longer you hold down the square button, the more enemies you can lock onto. If you destroy multiple enemies at once, your sub-gauge will be restored even more. Ending the explanation of the dash attack. I will explain about normal attack. When the enemy is at long distance range, the lock-on marker turns green. It turns red when the enemy is at close range. When the target is distant, press the square button, which will fire a shot. In a close range battle, you will initiate a slashing attack by pressing the square button. Ending the explanation about normal attack.
Yehuti is set up not to do that right now. I will explain about burst attacks. When Jehuti is not moving, you can change to burst mode by pressing the R2 button. You can perform burst attacks by pressing the square button in this mode. A close range burst attack is a burst blade attack. A long distance burst attack is a burst shot. By holding down the square button, you can charge power for a burst shot. Burst attacks are very powerful and penetrate the enemy's guard. A burst shot consumes sub-gauge power. Ending the explanation of burst attacks. I will explain how to guard yourself. By pressing the R1 button, Jehuti takes a guard position and can block enemy attacks. But not all attacks can be blocked. You cannot guard yourself from enemy burst attacks or grab attacks. Ending the explanation about guarding. I will explain how to switch between locked targets. When Jehuti gets close enough to an enemy, Jehuti locks on automatically. If there are multiple enemies, you can select an enemy to lock onto by pressing the L2 button. You can switch between locked targets by using the right stick. You can deselect the target by holding down the L2 button. Ending the explanation of switching lock targets. When an enemy gets close to Jehuti, the ring radar appears. The ring radar turns green when the enemy is far away. It turns orange when the enemy gets closer. The size of the ring radar represents the distance from the enemy. When an attack from outside the screen approaches Jehuti, a red ring radar appears. In this case, the marker shows the direction and distance of the incoming attack. The closer the attacker gets, the larger the ring radar becomes. Ending the explanation of the ring radar.
I will explain about Combo Smash. In a close range battle, you can perform a Combo Smash with a normal blade attack. Press the square button three times consecutively. If the fourth press is the square button, you will slash and push back the enemy. If the fourth press is the triangle button, you will slash and toss up the enemy. If the fourth press is the X button, you will slash and throw down the enemy. By pushing an enemy to a wall, ceiling, or floor, you can cause additional damage. Ending the explanation of Combo Smash. I will explain about camera control. If you are not locked on, Jehuti will move in the direction of the left stick. If you release the left stick, the camera will capture Jehuti from behind. You can also change the camera angle with the right stick. When aiming at a certain spot to attack, you can move the target marker with the right stick. Ending the explanation of camera control. Ending training. We found our objective at point zero four. Roger. Departing for zero four. Put me through to 663. Yes, I'll connect you now. Help me, Dingo! Where are you? My legs are damaged. Rick, where are you now? Ah! Don't move! I'll be there soon! Enemy approaching. It's approaching your way! position of 
is on. Destroy with a burst attack. Stop moving and keep pressing the R2 button. Then hit the square button for a burst attack. Jay with you, you'll have to give it to me. What does Barham want with Callisto? Oh? You don't look like a mining man to me. Get lost! You have
Frame, don't you? Maybe. Even if you're far off, that's too rough. It sure is. Who's the commander? You think I'll tell? Wait! Good job, Dingo. Are you all right? Yeah! Dingo, the enemy is approaching me! All right, I'll try to head them off. You will? Take care, Angie. What? High energy reaction inside enemy battleship. Entry is dangerous. If we don't do something, we'll be crushed along with Callisto. We have no choice. Objects which may be useful in battle with the circle button. Do you want to see how it's done? Yes, please. I will explain about grabbing objects. Jehuti can grab and use objects around it by pressing the circle button. When Jehuti is grabbing an object, Press the square button for a powerful close-range attack with the object. When Jehuti is holding an object, press the circle button again to throw it. Jehuti can guard itself with some objects from normally unguardable attacks by pressing the R1 button. Some objects will explode on impact. The explanation of grabbing objects is complete.
I will explain how to grab an enemy. By pressing the circle button near an enemy, Jehuti can grab it. You can also grab a guarding enemy. He is holding an enemy. Press the square button to swing it around as a weapon. When Jehuti is holding an enemy, press the circle button again to throw him. When Jehuti is holding an enemy, press the R1 button to guard with it. Guarding with a held enemy can block attacks that are normally unguardable. If you hold an enemy for too long, he can shake your hold off. You can paralyze an escaping enemy by bursting. Ending the explanation about grabbing enemies. Ending training. Destroy the cellar generating enemies. Metatron. this frame, don't they? Did you board this even though you knew? I didn't want to involve my friends. Also, there's something I have to confirm.
The gate to the next unit is open. Please follow the arrow. shield is not damaged by an energy attack. You will need to make a physical attack. A physical attack? A blade, or something used in close combat. But it seems the blades can't reach it. Look for something useful to attack. stack of building materials on the outside wall looks useful in an attack. You can grab by pressing the circle button when in front of something. Then lock on to the enemy and throw by pressing the circle button again. Is that you, Viola? Perhaps you're speaking to a battle AI. She's AI? Hey, Viola! It is just a replica being made by using her past battle data and part of her character. I don't think you can get a response from her. So, what happened to Viola? The applicable frame runner is already dead. She died? In the year 2172, the Antilia raid. It was a matter under the control of the Space Force. Balram attacked the colony orbiting a satellite of Jupiter, and stole an orbital frame which was under development. Was she involved with that? Which orbital frame was taken? The orbital frame Anubis. Jehuti was their target too, but they didn't get this frame. Jehuti was collected by someone who had much to fear from Balram before it was abandoned on Callisto. That is about right. Who was commanding the... Noman. What's the matter? It is a resonance reaction. Resonance? It is Anubis. that orbital frame back. Most enemy attack. 
too tough. I'm surprised you're still alive, Dingo. Long time no see, Noman. How have you been? I've been on vacation. You get off and come to my room. What are you doing on this ship anyway? If anything happens to my pals on Callisto, you'll pay. I didn't kill them. I don't believe you. Your skills are getting worse, Dingo. You've been slacking off. No, man. Ken, back off. Let me introduce you to Dingo. He was the leading pilot in our unit six years ago. Dingo, Egret? Military records show him dead. You're doing rather menial work compared to the old days. Have you been demoted to the outskirts? Shut up. You have come back under my command. Come back? You must be kidding! You'd better come back. It'll be fun from now on. I refuse! Your fooling around almost killed me back there. It's not funny! You don't understand. You can't deceive me with beautiful words like freedom and independence anymore! Do you realize how many of my comrades died back there? Say it! You killed them! I wouldn't know. You devil! Dingo! Come back. I like you. You make me sick. Dispose of the body.
me if you want to live. I've never heard anything like this before. Are you sure this order is from Colonel Noman? If not, why would I be doing such a thing? Ready? Please begin. stable pulse thank you you can go now uh, okay awake you've been asleep for two months uh. I shaved your beard Ada please look after him if I have to Demo Station, the gateway to Mars. How are you feeling? I feel really sick. It's better than feeling dead, isn't it? I didn't die, did I? You didn't, but you did lose your heart and lungs. So how can I still be alive? You can only stay alive when you're aboard Jehuti. Jehuti? The machine supplements your heart and lungs. That power comes from Jehuti. What? The minute you get off Jehuti, it will stop providing energy. You will die if you leave Jehuti. Oh. <laughs> Don't talk nonsense. Well, try it if you like. Get down, it's too dangerous. Don't do that again. Did you want to scare me to death? You're either stupid or insane! How could you do this to me? I had no choice. The cockpit is too small to put in all the gear needed to keep you alive. I didn't want this! I told you if you helped me, I would save your life. I don't remember. When did you say that? Just before, when you nearly died. I don't remember! You should be more appreciative of me. I saved your life, looked after you, and kept you hidden from the other crew for two months. Damn. Hook me up to proper vitals. I can give your real body back, so you'd better just accept my orders. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. How can I follow Baram? I'm not Baram. What? Quite the opposite. I'm with the Space Force. I'm Ken Marineris. I've been sent into hiding in Baram. <laughs> Are you serious? Don't be so surprised all the time. Why not? I said we don't have much time, didn't I? I didn't want to do this either. First, you have to escape from Deimos as soon as possible. You're in danger if we stay here wasting time talking. It's hard for... Noman is still alive, too. Don't you want vengeance on him? He killed my comrades. I have the same aim as you, so I won't do anything bad to you. Can I just ask you one question? What? Is it correct this year's winner was Hesperia Gales? What? Can't you be more serious? I'm very serious. Do you know the answer? We've no time for games on Mars. The 
catapult to eject ships is over there. You can get out if you go along this way. Satellite Deimos is under Baron now. Unmanned machines are on patrol to attack support units of the Space Force from Earth. Deimos is under Barum's rule? Not just Deimos. Mars and another satellite, Phobos. All of Mars' area has been under Barum's control. Noman has performed great deeds. That's awful. Unexpected things have occurred. Anyway, please consult Ada about the catapult.
I received a rescue signal. Ignore it. Connected. This is Taper. I'm stuck with a cargo of freight. Please help me. Which line is this, Ada? This is from the Space Force. Listen to his story, Dingo. <sighs> Taper, can you hear me? This is... This is Henry G. What's wrong with you? Are you the Space Force, Henry G? Something like that. Please help me. My unit has been attacked by Balrom. The controls on my fighter have not been working and I don't have any idea where I am. We can't help you then. Yes, please. I've got an important mission to carry out. Important mission? We are helping our friends on Mars. Who did you say you're helping? There are many people who can't escape from Vasilia after taking away the Vector Cannon. Vector Cannon? Please help Taper Dingo. We need to get it. I don't know. I can order Ada to stop feeding energy to you. You'll what? Ada? Damn! Okay, I'll do it. Taper, I'm coming to help you. Don't move from where you are. I'm hiding in a container. I start shaking after hearing the sound of gunfire. Ada, where was that message sent from? I can't find the particular point, but from all indications, it seemed not too far away. Taper said he's hiding in a container, and he got scared after hearing shots. Giving too much damage to the container will destroy it. Be careful. I know. I'm just going to knock with a shot. Henry G, this is Taper. A container with a serial number including one. To turn around, use the right stick. Yes, I am. Wow, I'm saved. Thank you. Ah! I'm not Baram, though this is an orbital frame. Stop! What's your assignment? Hey, I'll leave you behind if you keep being so dismal. What's your assignment? As I said, I'm trying to help you. Uh, all right, please help me. Hmm. Dingo, ask him about his orders. Shut up. I have to rescue the people in Vasilia County on Mars. They got stuck after they got a weapon to break through the defense systems of the enemy base. That's the one you told me about a moment ago. Yes. The Vector Cannon. It's very important to us to win. That's why I have to rescue them. You're kidding. How can you rescue them like this? It's my duty. Nonsense. It's enough you take me as far as the shooter to Mars with you. I know where my comrades are when I get to Mars. You're asking me to carry you to the shooter. Exactly. Let's go. Dingo, take him. We'll have him guide us to the Levs in Vasilia. I don't think he's that useful. Like them, we have to destroy Barom's military fortress. That's why we need that weapon. The military fortress? The military fortress. Alman. Alman. Oh, Henry G. I've got a program for an orbital frame, but I don't know anything about its contents, so you're welcome to use it. We obtained the device driver of the subweapon Geyser. It works against the enemy's power unit. It can restrict movement for a fixed time. A subweapon? Subweapons support your normal attack with special effects. Select a subweapon by tilting the left stick up or down while pressing the L1 button. Use it with the circle button. Each time you use the subweapon, the sub gauge goes down. Keep an eye on how much is left. Ada, what do I have to do when I grab Taper's Lev? Press the L1 button for a short while, so that grab appears in the subweapon window. Then press the circle button in front of the target you wish to grab. Press the circle button again to let go. Check your current position on the map.
Press the circle button in front of Taper's lab. Take me there. Hurry!
same time. Uh, cover me! ETR reaction gone. Assignment on Mars could be very similar to yours. I will let you know when I get there safely. Thank you for your help. Yeah, yeah. Don't hold me back in Mars. That's my line. Well, I'm leaving now. Hey, what's Mars like now? What do you want to know? How's the military situation? You should know. Anyway, I don't want to talk about it. By the way, what's your mission anyway? Quick, enemy approaching! Well, see you later! Reaction gone. 
doesn't look any different. What's that? Viola. I don't want to fight with Viola, even if she is AI. Let's go. This is bad. We're almost at the landing point. We've landed on Mars. Confirm our location. The edges of West Margaritifer, the state border of Basilia Territory. Dingo. First, you need to enter into Vasilia County. Wait. Tell me your location, and then... Wait. Ask Ada about the most suitable route to Vasilia. Wait a second! What's wrong? What's going on here? Burned ruins stretched as far as the eye can see. You were living in the backwoods, so you couldn't know. But in the last half year, the situation on Mars has changed drastically. Tell me more. It's a long story. I bet. Don't fall asleep. Hurry up. Half year ago, Bahram began to gain control of the military in every county on Mars. Then, the Mars Liberation Movement against Earth's oppression began to surface. Now, Bahram's war potential is very strong, far different from when you were around. The Space Force put up a stubborn resistance, but without a major war, Mars was occupied by Bahram in a flash. One month ago, the Space Force was almost wiped out, except for a few remnants. We attacked Basilia County, the Bahram foothold, with the total force we had then. That was thoughtless. Certainly. We knew what was going to happen. The Space Force suffered destruction, so there's not much time to destroy the remaining forces at the enemy base. Although, we did find a special thing. That's the Vector Cannon Taper mentioned. The Vector Cannon is a weapon that delivers a high-energy wave by space compression. The outer shield of the enemy fortress Almon defends from invasion with a mass dislocation created by space compression. The Vector Cannon is the only weapon that can nullify that defense and pierce it. Urinbeck Catapult, Orbital Frame, Vector Cannon, so they're all byproducts of Metatron. It's a bad habit of mankind to want to use its new toys immediately. Don't you agree? However, the military unit has been missing in Vasilia since they acquired the Vector Cannon. Taper, who you met on Deimos, must have come to get it back. Why is it so important? Dingo, do you know about the Almont Project? I only recognize the name. When Dr. Rikoa Hardiman was in good health. Noman's father. After Dr. Hardiman died, his son Ridley, that is Noman, took over command of the plan. He then made a full-scale model. Almon is a huge military fortress that uses a great amount of Metatron to construct weapons of mass destruction. When it is fully operational, it won't make sense for Earth to send any amount of forces against it. 
Almon will have over a million times the power of Anubis, and you've seen the damage that can do. Can you imagine what it will be like? Why did Noman want to get Jehuti? He's already got a great weapon, hasn't he? Actually, Anubis and Jehuti were developed as part of the Almon plan. What do you mean? Those two were a key element in starting Almon. That plan was made by Dr. Hardiman. Only those two machines can make Almon move or stop. So, Noman has already got Anubis. He probably thinks Jehuti is a bother. He either wants it, or wants it destroyed. Normally, Anubis and Jehuti have the same abilities, so only Jehuti can fight against Bara more potential, which was much increased through the technological research of Anubis. That's why you made me have such a terrible experience. No need to thank me. Mars terraforming is still a long way from perfect, so it's still too weak to be a battlefield. Several years ago, there was an attack on Earth by the hawkish faction of Mars, but it was a failure in the end because another power from Mars intervened. Then, Baram learned that they should put pressure on Mars with military force before attacking Earth, strengthening their foothold. The Space Force's power couldn't match Baram. Earth can't approach Mars, which is under constant surveillance by Almon. Earth won't be talking big to Mars. Earth and Mars bow down to Almon. Because of Noman, actually. Is Almon in Vasilia? Anubis and Noman are there too. Almon is already getting ready. He must be happy. Hey, we have to stop Almon and Noman. We have the same purpose, don't we? Our cooperation is not so bad after all, is it? I know you'll cut off my life support if I refuse. You have your duty to do. I don't care about Earth or Mars. My aim is to get Noman. You're all just the same as Baram, aren't you? So don't go thinking you're champions of justice. Sorry to interrupt your conversation, but an unidentified combat vehicle is approaching. Hey, I have to go. I'll disconnect. N no, wait! Damn it. Let's be done with it.
loaded down.
can you say if you're not with Barum? You must be Leo Stenbuck. You know him? Ada. Long time no see. You remember me? Yes, the data is a perfect match with the previous runner. <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. You're the owner of this frame, aren't you? That's right. Elena? That's not your business. Anyway, get out of Jehuti. You want me to leave Jehuti? Don't be silly. I can't leave even if it means I die. How come? That's not your business. What do you plan to do with Jehuti? I think it could be sold at a high price. Are you going to Almar? Ada, please answer my question. You're going to Almar, aren't you? So what if I am? Do you know that Ada intends to self-destruct Jahuti on Alman? Are you sure? It is true. Wait a second! What's going on? Whose order is that? It's a command which arose from the basis of a program. The basis of a program? Are you kidding me? Who would allow such a thing? Hey, Ada, I won't allow you to do that! You're worried as if it concerns you. Well, it does! This is the meaning of the existence bestowed upon me. Are you stupid? How can you throw away your life for no reason? I don't need any reasons. All right, I get rid of Alman. Then you don't need to blow up Jehuti. Isn't that right? What? And then, once Alman is destroyed, you'll be alive. That's enough, isn't it? You should take time to think about the meaning of your existence later. But... What's your name? You shut up. I'm Dingo. Dingo, I'm sorry, but it's me who will destroy Alman. What? I can't stomach giving Jehuti to Baron. I won't give it up either. I don't want to lose Jehuti. You rely on me. I'll get rid of it while you're doing your homework at home. Okay. I will head towards Alman after helping the Space Force and Vasilia. If I fail, please carry out my task for me. Hey. I don't want Ada to fight. I want to finish it. Why? For Ada's sake. You're a funny guy. Oh, please take this with you. We obtained the device driver of the subweapon Gauntlet. It stuns enemies to a distance by physical impact. If you can hit an enemy into the wall using the Gauntlet, they will suffer double damage. I see. Dingo. You saw Anubis? Yeah. Please be careful with Anubis. Even though you are on Jehuti... Don't worry. I'll bring your Jehuti back to you later in one piece. Anyway, you were a good fighter. I trust your skills. What's that? It's the Baram fleet. They defend from outside invasions. Is Leo alright? He hasn't been captured yet. There's too much trouble in the sky. For your own good, you better act with reserve like you're a stranger. Anyhow, news will soon leak out. But it is much better if no one finds out as late as possible. Alright, I'll explain what you do next. You can enter Vasilia through the south gate. But first, you need to unlock it. You have to destroy two facilities on both sides of the gate before you can go into Facilia territory. So, I'll need to destroy two facilities to unlock the gate, is that right? That's it. Security in the territory has been much stricter since the Space Force attacked, so be careful. I will. I'm leaving Deimos for Mars now. I'll let you know when I get there. The crews on Deimos are starting to suspect me. Really? Serves you right. Hey. Why can't you be more cooperative? I think I am. I shouldn't trust rumors. What? Nothing. See you later. Hmm. 
There is a route through the canyon in front of the gate. Metatron is confirmed close by. Go and collect it first.